My name is Marva Cutler. On June the 21st, it was a summer morning, 2011, I was hit by a car from behind and left for dead, and that was when I, where I was found in the middle of the road. When I arrived at the scene, Marva had steam coming out of her. She was contorted to where you knew the human body cannot twist like that. I went up, knelt down by her. I said, Marva, it's Steve, I'm here. Just try to listen to my voice and try to stay with me. Help's on the way. And then I looked at her and I didn't think what was there could survive. And I just leaned over to her ear again and I said, Marva, it's all right. If you can't stay with me, just go to sleep. It's all right. And at that moment, she stopped breathing. The next several weeks for Marva were a battle to survive and heal. After intensive reconstruction, surgery, and therapy, she managed to walk again. And after four years, many of her wounds were healing, especially on her leg, which was severely damaged in the accident. But things quickly took a turn for the worse. I went to the wound clinic. We felt it was doing okay. And I had stopped going to the wound clinic. And, and then I noticed in March a scab form right here on my ankle. And I, you know, scabs aren't bad, I thought. Must be something healing. And then it fell off at the end of March. And I looked at it, I was cleaning it, and it was deep. And it got bigger. And I knew I had to go to the wound clinic. So I went in there and they x-rayed it. They excavated it, cut it, cleansed it, and it was showing my bone. They said it must have never healed from the accident four years earlier. That was when Dr. Klomp said, sorry, Marva, medicine won't heal it. After visiting multiple doctors and experts, Marva was quickly losing hope of her leg healing until a friend of hers had an idea and made a phone call to Fusion Specialty Pharmacy. We are first and foremost a specialty pharmacy. So our emphasis is on making customized, unique medications to fit a unique health need that's not met currently in the market. So I got a call from Steve Penman um, about Marva's situation. And I'm, I wasn't familiar with her story before all of this. I didn't live here at the time, and so I didn't know anything about her. Um, he just called and said that he had a patient that um, we needed a wound care product for. She had a wound that was a, a number of years old that had, had since reopened and they were having issues getting it to close. A lot of times you have a wound that has unique needs um, that you don't have a commercial product for and you need to make up something specific. Uh, in her case, it was because she needed something to enhance circulation in the wound. She needed something to prevent infection in the wound um, and also to, to stimulate tissue growth. And so all of those things need to be put into one product. And so that's what we did with her to address her unique need. I said do it twice a day and I put the first application on when I got home. I picked it up on a Tuesday morning and then I was going to dress it, clean it and apply it again and I took off the bandage and I looked at my wound, it had a total different characteristics on the top of it. It was smoother, it was better colored, it wasn't off colored like it was before and, and the skin had smoothed out and I was shocked. I was so amazed, I could not believe one application could make a difference like that. I don't think any of us expected the, the response that she would have got, at least not so fast. And when I saw the results, the first application, I was so excited. I had been on a plateau for a month and a half that had done nothing. My wound had just stayed this way that it was. And I started telling people. I wanted to tell doctors. I wanted them to have the same experience that I had to help their life, help their wounds, have a better quality of life, give them hope. And that's what it did for me. It totally gave me hope and excitement and, and I could get better. I could really get better finally.